I came back with a very interesting chart, bar chart, where the highest value color get changed and the lowest value color get changed as the it's a dynamic chart. So as soon as the value get changed, your chart will get the change. So let's test it. Suppose when the Bob achieves the sale of thirty thousand, I able to know that he has the highest. And if someone else has reduced, so I will know that Davis has the lowest sale. So. This is a dynamic visualization where even one can even easily identify which is the highest and lowest. So let's learn and get into that how to do that. So here I have the sample database. So I have the person name sales achieve, but now it's very tough to understand who is the highest and lowest. And when I prepare even a chart, even I'm not able to know. So first we have to calculate the highest value. The formula for calculating the highest is max, and then selecting this range. F four, so I get the max value, but I want this max value to be the value where is the maximum. So for that, I will use the dynamic function, make it dynamic by using if formula. If this cell is equal to the maximum value, only then I require this cell. Else, I require blank. So in this first scenario, fifteen thousand is a not maximum. So that C three, this criteria true is not there. So I will get the blank value. Let's check when I click OK. I will get that blank. So I will get the highest only when it is twenty seven thousand. Let's tell if it is converted into thirty thousand. I get value here. Control C. Now for the minimum, there is a formula called min. Then select this range, F four, for freezing it. And I get a minimum value, but I want it to dynamic, so I will use the if formula. When this cell is equal to the minimum, then I require this value. Else, I require blank. So two inverted commas. So my database is ready. I get the highest and lowest value in the sales achieved. Just select your old database and go to the insert tab and there is a recommend chart just click on the recommended chart so i want this bar chart just click okay so i have this chart where this sales achieve highest and lowest are separate but i want this to be overlap of this this highest and lowest to overlap so for that just click the blue bars and press control 1 to activate the format series bar Here is the option called series overlap. Just select it to hundred percent, and done. So this blue, this series is overlap. Now just change the color for the highest value. Format it as green color, and for the lowest, format it as a, I think red, because it will be highlighted. The issue, and for the blue, I will just change. This color into some lighter color so that our green and red are highlighted. So this way chart is done. I just change the title to sale achieved, sale achieved. My work is done. Let's check. Suppose if this value get increased twenty eight thousand, it is the highest. And for lowest, let's check. Suppose if this is the lowest, I get the lowest. So this way, I have the analysis. We easily say Alice has the lowest sale achieved right now. Diana has achieved the highest sale. Now we can uh, analyze. This is a great visualization. We can prepare with that. So thanks for watching this video. Hope you like that video.